YouTube, it's Pax here again, doing RuneScape still, Desert Treasure, we got all the diamonds in the last episodes, got the last diamond in the last episode, now we're on the final leg of the thingy, going into the actual pyramid, and searching for Azanadra. We need to find the initial person that we talked to at the beginning of this. Is he still at the thingy? At the tele, tele, tele pad, the tele pad, the, the lodestone. Yeah, here he is, Eblis. Here we go. I have all four diamonds of Azanadra. I know it. Our greatest hero, he was unkillable. And then the cowardly traitors who stole their lands did not know what to do with him. For his hatred that for them was no was as strong as his magics. In the end they cast a spell upon him, chant him in a stone structure to the south of here. The giant pyramid. They stole his very life force, the essence of his power, and trapped him. In with four crystals, the very same four diamonds, which you have now recovered from the brigands who stole it from us. Stole from us. The four pillars surrounding the structure are keeping the contaminant spell, containment spell intact by placing a diamond in each. You'll breach the magic defenses and begin to restore as an address power. And be able to enter the structure. Of course. Why not? Go praise them and free. As it The path will be hard for his prison as well as traps and danger to prevent his rescue. But he will reward you beyond your wildest dreams when you free when freed. Quickly. All of these centuries, Lord Zadr after all of these centuries, Lord Zadr Lord as an is free. You must spare no what is that? That is a unicorn. Holy crap. Okay. Place the diamonds upon the pillars and enter the pyramid so that you may free him. You already said that. Let's do this. Where is the pyramid? It is right there. Let's do this. Tomb Raider. I've never played that game. Neither the current nor the original of any of the originals actually okay blood fire goes in here because it's red ding 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 this one smoke gale let's go gale diamond is it the gale yes it's the gale and then, what is this one? This one is the ice. Oh, that was a hard one. That one sucked. And then the rock. As an Adra, we are coming to free your tiny sphincter. The magic has been lifted. Force preventing access to the pyramid is now vanished. Okay. You should get a water skin for any time traveling the desert. I start dying of thirst. Okay, let's get in here before I die. Okay, where to now? Let's go this way. Oh, I should activate this. So that way, it's the same one that we used before. So that... Um... Whenever our run energy gets depleted, it automatically comes back. And these, these mummies are neutral, so they don't, they don't care. But there are traps that spawn randomly. And if you stand on them for too long, they, uh, they suck you to the beginning. Okay, one down. Now where is the path? It is over there. Go. I hope there aren't any wall crushers. 
That was a thing with the Florin's little helper. There were these wall crushers that would come out of the walls and they would hit you and do a bunch of damage if you stood by them for too long. I did bring, I don't have my magic stuff because I didn't think, I, I don't really think I need it. So I brought my whip, my abyssal whip, and my offhand dragon longsword so that I have two weapons. And then I got wicked robes to reduce my weight so that my run energy depletes slower. I, mean, I don't even think it's depleted at all. Okay. Another great thing with RuneScape is you don't actually have to navigate these passages and stuff. Um, it's, uh, you just click where you want to go on the map and it'll find automatically the shortest route to there. I mean, normally this would be really bad. Oh, no, 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 there's scarabs. They're even neutral. Wow. Wait, are they? No, they're following me. But they're really slow. And I'm fast because I got my wicked robes. Anyways, scarabs, they sometimes come out and will attack you. I think they come out of these mummies. Um, sarcophagi. Nope, they just come out of the ground. Get going. That's the annoying thing with scarabs is that when they come out of the ground, they stop you walking. So if you're standing on a trap, you get sucked in. Okay, there's four floors. There's Azanadra. He's in that big room right there. What? Why can't I go in? Just click near it. Okay. Here we go. So yeah, if my combat lower level... My what? No, move. Go. Get going. That was a trap. Uh, what the heck? Mummy. Just randomly popped out of a tomb. That's what happens, not scarabs. Mummies, they come out of tombs randomly if you stand by them for too long. So anyways, with these wicked robes, they reduce your weight. They don't, they're not very good in the way of armor. But they do reduce your weight so you can run f for a longer distance before your, your, um... Run, energy gets depleted. Move, smart one. Open the door. Now I must eat. Here he is, Azanadra. Duck. Hello. Oh, you look really weird. I knew I could not have me here for long. Well done, soldier. Tell me how goes the battle. Battle. You don't know about the battles? More time must have passed than I thought. Always talking about the God Wars. Tell me what news of great Padua. Do her shining spires of Lazar still stand? And what of the glorious Enclar? The fortress is still intact. Sorry, I've never heard of them. No. My lord, what has become of you? Can't hear your voice in my head anymore. Who's talking about Zaros? Yeah, he's gone. I thanks to a brave warrior for helping me free me from this accursed doom, but it seems I have much to do to make amends. The shining cities no longer stand, and it means we must have fall, failed, my lord. How long have I been trapped here, master? Have you truly just been dispatched from this world? Warrior, for your efforts in freeing me, I offer you the gift of knowledge. Yeah, um, reading gives you knowledge. Knowledge is power. Power corrupts. Study hard, kids. Join the dark side. Whoa. I bestow upon you the ancient magics taught, taught me by my lord. That doesn't make sense. Taught me by my lord. Taught to me by my lord before his disappearance. 
We use them well in battles of our, of our people, for our people, yeah. They will replace the knowledge you previously had, which you may switch between them by praying at the altar in this room at any time. So he's talking about the ancient spellbook. I trust that we shall meet again, adventure. I offer the blessing of myself and my master and all of your endeavors. Thank you. Now I must leave you, for there must be traces of my master's power left somewhere. Feel free to use the portal. I shall create to return here easily in the future. Whoa. So I get... So that's done. I got three quest points. I get 2,000 magic experience. I get the ancient magic and two spins on the thingy. I should go and establish know what's happening here. There is also a mini quest that I may do. Okay, uh, let's pray at the altar. Get my magic. What? Oh, no. Okay. Strange wisdom. So that means... Yes, I get the ancient magic. Okay, there aren't... There are some teleports. Oh, Santistan. Pedwa. That place. Lazar. That place. <laughs> that place. Gorak. <laughs> and a Carl. And there's no skilling. There's only combat. There is some... Ooh, Palaplor. Strike. Wow. So it requires a staff. What do some of these things do? How do I get an ancient staff? Okay, well, regardless. Um, let's enter the portal. Enter tunnel. Oh, that goes straight here. Well, that's convenient. Okay. No! Why did I do that? Okay. No. Enter the portal. Oh, I am bad. Um, is that the Calphite Hive? Exiled Calphite Hive. Okay, anyways. Let's get back to Eblis before the brown stuff hits the fan. The fecal excrement. Um, with the desert, because I am going to die of thirst. Because I forgot the water skin. For some reason. Oh no. Oh no. I accidentally opened my media player. 